Hey folks, it's Jir and welcome back to Let's Play Earth of Iron Tree with Austrian Guri. And uh, we're still pushing on Russia. She'll be falling very soon. Like, probably like this time around. Or very close this time around. I don't feel like uh, they're gonna last much longer. Last, last. What, what the hell does that mean? Last, much longer. They're 80% nearing surrender. There are 21.6% of their important cities occupied and we're getting closer and closer to more important cities here. Uh, gonna grab Smolensk, pushing also for Oro and then we will go for Kalugan Tula. And meanwhile Germany is pushing here for the capital probably. It will be a very good idea Germany, you know. Pushing for the capital will be a great idea. After that... Uh, I don't know exactly what we're going to do with our forces once we capture Russia, we conquer Russia. Probably, uh, I don't know, deal with Serbia, Romania, most likely. Maybe if Roman joins us that will be helping a lot. Alright, Spearhead Doctrine. I feel like Russia is like, oh no, oh no, oh no, we're, we're losing it, we're losing it guys, we're losing it guys. Shit, what should we do? Something along these lines. I'll not be surprised. Alright, pushing Smolensk now. With all our troops. Alright, so we got one more advancement. Ooh, we can actually uh, build airships now. Airships. Gonna build just one airship, 13 man. Two manpower. It's not that bad, but still pretty long and expensive. Can't wait to get the uh, Russian IC. What's that? Inefficient research, integrated support. Great, now it's gone. And here the score is going up. And here we'll be attacking there. I'm gonna give them another unit to help attacking. These guys will move forward. These guys are already moving forward. And we're getting close to Aurel now. Just gonna push around. Oh, I thought for a moment we just lost some territories here. I was really afraid. But that's not the case. So that's great. We're at 24 war score here for that invasion of that city. I don't know where we are all going. We're all moving there. Now 33%. 34%. Here we're pushing well. Germany, please don't steal my stuff. Keep your own lines. Alright. Mm. Nearing 80% of surrender process progress. So that probably means not a lot is left. Not a lot is left, baby. Right, let's see these assholes, all they look like. Seems like good advantage on our side. Most of them. Yeah, these are gonna hold up the line here. Get some nice pushing all around. That's very nice to see. Much different than what we were used to for the last few months. 
heavy artery site will be removed from the research queue because we cannot research that. I need to push here that division there. Yeah, we've got massive amount of forces moving around. All right, we capture Smolensk. Let's move all the forces. Let's take all of here. Wow, glorious. Let's see where the rest of the BPs are. They're all over there. So we just need to cut that way now. Great. And Germany, just take care of that here. Now, how close are you now? Ooh, ooh, 88. 88 percent oh man oh man wow all right so these guys are actually pushing forward let's push forward everywhere man let's just do it all right Okay. I have a lot of units here. Can it help out here? Oral is ours. Inefficient research, heavy artillery carriage. That's fine. We'll remove that. yeah good pushing all around man that's just insane that's just insane can't wait to see uh you guys fall down 88 we really don't need a lot now all right so we're capturing rl and we'll start moving the forces up north we need a lot more forces for Kalkua, kaluga and tula So all of these are gonna push here then. These guys are pushing here. And they're backing up all over the place. Okay, we got an attack going on. That seems to be doing fine. Let's go for Kaluga. Hmm. RL is still being captured. And all their forces are here. Much of the massive more forces are there. Germany is pushing very well around. Just need to grab a uh, Talon. That will fix a part of the issue we have with them here. I'm going to start building a airport around here. Air base. So that when we'll deal with these, then uh, everything will be normal. Yeah, let's, uh, let's see how that's going to happen for the uh, assassination of Franz Ferdinand. Is it Franz Ferdinand? I don't remember. I think it's Franz Ferdinand that got assassinated if that's what you're wondering I'm saying, uh, talking about that's what I'm talking about but right now I just want to get rid of freaking Russia that's all I want destroy the resistance I think we just got an RCD 92% baby I think it's like 2 or 3% per city so Important cities come to me, baby. Come to me. All right, we just destroyed the Nepal troops. Nepalese troops. All right, more crushing going on. Pushing for Kaluga and Tula very nicely. Mm 
Mm -hmm. Some more units here. Right, guys running out of supplies. The units all over the place. That's my old fruit. God damn it. God damn it. I have troops all over the place. <laughs> I'll need to rearrange the organizational structure after. Probably. Yeah, I'll probably need to do so. Yeah, let's leave, leave a small stack of mountain troops here to defend. I don't think they have much chance. We have a really massive attack going on, so I don't think they have really any chance of coming back from that. But still, oh, we don't have any troops here. They could take back Kursk, and that'd be terrible. So let's move a couple of troops to Kursk. Just to secure it. Kaluga, I'm coming for you. Kaluga, I'm coming for you. And these are just HQs, but I'm closing here. I'm gonna leave one unit there, just as a defense mechanism. And otherwise, uh, it's okay. It's all okay. The whole line is defended. The whole line is victorious. All of these units ran out of supplies, of course. That's the issue that need to supply them. So let's get closer. Need to move my HU forward. Probably helped me a lot. All these units are gonna push here. Alright, gonna push here with all my units there. That's pretty much all I'm doing, pushing all the units. Massive army pushing. That's some campaigning, if you're asking me. Alright. Combat medicine is inefficient, so let's remove that. Germany's closing on here. Mm. Russia, 92%. And we're nearing Kaluga now. As we forget about that, forget about that troop here. Just chill back here. We're moving for Kaluga now, anyway. Alright, gonna leave one unit here, move the rest there. Don't really need to defend against Russia. And if they start pushing back, they ain't gonna save themselves. Come on. Got a few minutes just just before the end of this episode to get Russia on its knees. Come on, massive push. Massive push all over the place. That's what we want. That's what we're asking for. They're trying to push me back here on the infantry side. Uh, the infantry side, I mean on the uh, cavalry I got here. But it's not an important point, so it doesn't really matter. But still, man, it's closing on. Let's go to speed 5 and finish that war. Because at this point, that's all I want to do. Oh, Kaluga is wide open, man. Come on. Come on. Oh. 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 We actually finished it before the First World War. It took about a year and three months. But we captured Russia. Wow. Wow. Uh, we got some uh, stuff going on to the British. Yeah. Nepalese got a couple of troops around. British here got a couple of troops. Just gonna crush them once and for good. Wow, look at that. 
will you look at that? My God. Got 269 uh, industrial capacity now. So, wow, we did it. We did it before even the actual assassination of Franz Ferdinand. So, it took a year and three months, but we freaking did it. Germany's dead. Not Germany, yes, sorry. Russia is dead. Fully dead. Nothing can stop us now. Oh, that's great. That's really great. It's all under occupation, so we'll just clear out these forces. Uh, let's do that right now. Just clear out these forces there. Don't want to see these forces around. Come on. Come on. Destroy these armies. They have no supplies anyway. Yeah, I think they're all uh, destroyed right now. Okay, so that means, uh, wow. Beautiful, isn't it? Good thing uh, Afghanistan and China are there. They're blocking off uh, uh, India's troop. Maybe Persia will let him through, no. But, uh, come on. Are you drifting toward us? You are drifting toward us. I'm um, an empire. We'll need you. Because I'm going to deal with the Balkans next. And, uh, oh yeah, that's very exciting. Very, very exciting. And, uh, thank you for watching. Russia, Russia is down. Russia is gone. Are they in exile? Yeah, they're in exile. They exiled here. <laughs> Come on. Hmm. Add war goal on Russia. I don't know. It's occupied at least. It's all occupied. They're just in exile. We'll see what we can do to deal with them. Probably don't have a lot of forces on their little islands. But that's great, folks. That's very great. Alright, so thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this one. Because uh, now we're, we're stopping invading Russia. We're, we're doing something better, something greater. Ah, oh, that's great. I did better than Austin Durfs now, so I'll need to change the camping name. Wow, incredible. Thank you for watching. See you next time.